We'll wait for some uh, some people to join. Yeah, I know there are people watching on the web. Um, oh, hey, Gary. Hey, Gary, guess where I am? Hey, Gary. Yeah, Arizona, yes, that is correct. Okay, flying lady, great to see you. But, uh, Gary, who else from the Allen High class of 81 lives in Arizona? Initials J.M. Mutsai. <laughs> no. Jay Moraine. I'm, I'm staying at Jay Moraine's house uh, while I'm here in Santan, Arizona, at the extreme east end of the Valley of the Sun, which is like Phoenix and Mesa and Tempe and Scottsdale and Chandler and Gilbert and all those other, you know, little towns. So, um... Oh, Murtaugh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's right. He lives around here, too. And uh, a year behind us, Timmy O'Connor uh, owns, like, the the, the best uh, uh, bakery in uh, in the Valley. Hi, everybody. Uh, this is William Friedman from the Cross Country Local, an expedition to go from the East Coast to the West Coast, clear across America, using only local and regional transit. And um, I've... I've got it all sewn now. Good posture, Doc. Good posture, Doc. Please follow me here and please follow me on Facebook. Good posture, Doc. My back is freaking killing me. I I, I am looking for a referral to uh, for a therapeutic massage. I mean, I'm not looking for a happy ending. I'm not saying no, but I'm not looking for a, a happy ending. I'm just saying is when I stand up, my uh, my lumbars let me know. And I, I don't think it's a skeletal thing. I think it's it's just muscular because stretching out seems to help. Um, anyway, um, I just wanted to let everyone know what my plans are. First of all, my you know I, I came into town last night. Uh, Want to follow up on something, Jules? Great! I just sent you a, a, a message on uh, on Facebook. Please uh, please reply. I'm heading your way on Saturday. So, uh, so let's absolutely get together. All right. So, uh, yeah, uh, anyway, I, uh, just to bring you up to date, um, last night or, or, or the, yeah, yeah. Two nights ago, I was, uh, I, I, I spent at the Harris casino, um, at, in, in the no man's land between Tucson and, uh, and the Valley of the Sun, uh, a little strip of land called Pinal County, which, is just a waste of map. <laughs> it's it's just the, the the intersection of to hell and gone. So uh, anyway, there is uh, the the Gila River uh, reservation there. There's the there's the Akchin um, Indian community there, and they have a deal with Harris Casino and and so uh, for for fifty bucks for the night, I figure okay, I'll I'll, I'll stay at Harris. And if you saw my uh, my scopes from Mulvane, uh, Kansas, you know I'm not a big casino guy. It's just not my vice. I, I don't really feel the uh, the need to play. It's you know I, I'm not big on glitz. So um, so I'm just kind of hanging out there. I got to see uh, a Spectre for six bucks. They they have this like half priced first run uh, movie theater, very, very plush. So I did that. Had a couple of good meals. Um, but, uh, stayed away from the gambling floor until, uh, uh, my, my best friend from elementary school, a guy named Jay Moraine, um, ended up, uh, moving out here and got married and he and his wife have this, uh, have this house in, uh, in, uh, Santan. Um, and his wife works like relatively close to the casino. And so she gave me, she offered to give me a lift up here and, uh, you know, it was, it was very nice of, of Christina and uh, certainly unexpected. I had intended to take the Harris Fun Bus up to Chandler uh, uh, from you know, from the casino because that's how I got to the casino. Is I took the Fun Bus from the north northern 
end of Tucson um, up to the casino, and I wanted to hop on another bus and take that up to uh, the Phoenix area. And I get to the casino, and they said, you really think you're the first one to think of that? <laughs> no. No, you, you're the only bus you can get on is the one that you got off. You can go back to Tucson and try something else, but we're not going to, to wave you through to, uh, to the Phoenix area. Um, so I did a little digging around, and had I had a little more time to plan, I could have gotten with a van pool or a car pool. Uh, they, they do run those uh, at, uh, at the municipal level here, and uh, they're not very good at it, but they, they've got it. And um, uh, another thing is, is that... Uh, is that Harris doesn't run the bus themselves. They subcontract out to something called All Aboard America. And if I called All Aboard America and said, I'm at Harris, I need a lift up to Phoenix, they just said, uh, sure, fine, we might not be able to give you a reservation, but you can just walk on as long as there's an open seat. So as long as I wouldn't have told, as long as I didn't tell the casino that that's what I was doing, I could have still done that. But anyway, I accepted a lift, a lift from a, an overnight host to come up here. And uh, so uh, last night I was here with the Marines. I'll be staying here again tonight, uh, taking a nice long overdue break from the road because I've, I've been nonstop since Fort Stockton. Um, and uh, so it's nice sleeping in the, the same bed a couple nights in a row. And then tomorrow I'm just going as far as Tempe, which is how it's pronounced, emphasis on the second syllable, Tempe, Arizona. And uh, uh, Jay and I have uh, uh, another friend from, from our old neighborhood who owns the, uh, I think it's called the Honeymoon uh, 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 Bakery. Uh, he's, he makes like the most famous, uh, best regarded wedding cakes in Arizona. And he's, he's really an amazing pastry chef. And, you know, it, it, again, serendipity. Remember, I happen to have a friend who lived halfway between Harrisburg and, uh, and Lewistown, Pennsylvania, uh, Nancy Deal. So you know, she was able to, to put me up for the night and, and that disconnect in the road. Well, what I need to do for Saturday morning to get on the bus up to Laughlin is to get on a bus in Tempe at five in the morning on a Saturday. It just so happens that I have a friend from my old neighborhood who gets up at three to four in the morning every Saturday anyway, because he's got to bake a dozen wedding cakes. So, so it's perfect. He, you know, he's from the, the, the place where the, the Laughlin bus, the, the uh, Paradise Valley bus picks up for the Laughlin run is like right between his house and, and his bakery. So it's like, I'm, I, I'm on his way, you know, 3,200 miles away from where we grew up. And I'm, on his way to, to work on a Saturday morning at some god awful hour. So uh, that's the view from here. I'll be spending um, probably Saturday, Saturday and Sunday night uh, in Laughlin, and then uh, on up to uh, to Vegas on uh, the Silver Rider, which is the Southern Nevada uh, public transit system, and uh, they've got uh, you know regular you know, once a day public transit from Laughlin up to Vegas. And then I'm going to hang out with my cousin Mark for a couple of days. Uh, and um, we were just trying to get us a room at the Flamingo. That's not happening, but, you know, I don't know where I'll end up, but somewhere. Oh, one more thing I wanted to say about Harris. And I said, I'm not a casino guy, but um, when, it, when it turned out that uh, I was going to have to wait, nice, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's like uh, a lot of us have gone on to uh, to very different places and have have been leading some uh, some fascinating lives. So uh, so yeah, it's it's really great to see everybody. Um, it, this happened at at, at Harris. Uh, while I, I figured I had an hour to kill him, I hadn't gambled all all the time I was at Harris, and then I uh, I, I hear that. Uh, that Christina Moraine is going to be at least an hour before she can pick me up. So I've got an hour to kill. I'm in a casino. So uh, I sit down at my favorite slot machine. Yes, I've got a favorite slot machine. It's the only one I really have any interest in playing. It's, it's Wonder Woman. And it's got, uh, you know, it, it's all dedicated to Linda Carter's uh, 
a one and only authentic uh, perform- performance of Wonder Woman. I, I have no interest in seeing this new Wonder Woman. It's, it's always going to be Linda as, as Diana Prince for me. So uh, anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm there at, at I, I stick the $20 bill in, in the machine and I press the button and next thing you know, I'm hearing ding, 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 Wonder Woman! And, 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 and the theme song starts playing and people start looking at me and I'm like, well, what's this about? And I, I didn't seem to have won any money, uh, but everyone, everyone's here, big winner, big winner, big winner. And, and, and I turned to the guy next to me who's also playing a Wonder Woman machine and, and he says, oh, you just uh, won uh, uh, free games. Well, it's not the same as money, but okay, I won free games. I won like 18 free games. So I pressed the, the button 18 more times and came up with a winner, like 10 or 12 of them. And, uh, you know, it wasn't a big winner. The $20 turned into 75 bucks. So essentially what happened is Linda Carter paid for my room for the night. <laughs> and uh, so that, that I get to say that the rest of my life. No one can take that away from me. Again, this is William Friedman from the Cross Country Local, a journey from the Atlantic to the Pacific using only local and regional transit. Uh, follow me here on Periscope. Uh, invite your friends to follow on Periscope. Uh, we're on Facebook at Cross Country Local Community Page and on Instagram and Twitter, hashtag XC Local. That's X Ray Charlie Local for Cross Country Local. And I will see you along the route. Already saw you, Gary. Hope to, to see you, Jules.